Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back. Once again, I'm Machine Gun, and I have three separate uh, pops from Pop in a Box for you today. I've already cut them open and just popped the tops, just to make it easier. So without further ado, let's get into it. Pop in a Box always uses this uh, this cardboard stuff. It is pretty thick. So the first one we have is one of the two Corellas. I ordered both, but only one of them has shipped so far. All right, so we have the Corella Reveal. I have yet to see this movie. But I thought these hops are really sick. Let's see if this thing would focus. There we go. I like the little bit of shiny stuff, like around her mask, like it should be. It looks pretty good. I don't see any damage on the front. Looks okay. These boxes can usually take a good little beating, like these boxes they ship them in. Um, they're, they're a thicker type of cardboard than the crap that, uh, most places ship in, so, like, it's good. But, yeah, so I'm also waiting for the Making Art one. I'm very excited to see this new Corella movie, um, but I really am not paying, like, $40 or whatever it is to watch it early from, uh, Disney, so I will just wait. Next one, we have Jerry. From Tom and Jerry. He made these cute little ones. Um, okay, he's supposed to be up that high. I was like, why is he up so high? So you could actually see him. He's got like a stand below him. So I thought maybe he'd fall him. But yeah, his plastic's actually like that. It's kind of weird. Uh, in front of the pop was guy. He does look absolutely adorable. This is lifted up a little bit. Look at me, he's so cute. I also did order Tom. But for some reason, once again, he's not ready to go yet. So, you know, it looks okay. Pretty good to me. This thing's a little lifted, but doesn't look like any damage, so like we're okay there. But yeah, look at him, he is really cute. Nice little proportion. I like that he's smaller, he'll definitely be smaller than uh than Tom. And last but not least, uh you just nicely come out, please. Sometimes I try to get them out of the box. And I already just noticed a smidge, I don't know if you can see it, there's like a ripple. A ripple right here. For some reason, it, just these princess ones have come like with minor damage, which is really annoying me because I bought this line. And each one of them I've had, well, so far I've had all four of these got delivered, except I got two Tianas for some reason instead of a Jasmine. And then the company was like, yeah, we sold them all. Sorry. And then like refunded me. So I had to buy it for more money on like another one of my sites. So I was not pleased. It's the first time Pop in a Box kind of like fucked me over. And I was a little disappointed because like I pre-ordered the Jasmine. And then you gave me two Tianas. Like that's that's not chill. But she just looked really cute. Sebastian's face looks a, a little scary. But like really cute pop all together. I do like, I do like the new line. It is definitely the Aurora that made me buy it. But yeah, there's... A little bit of damage here, but other than that, it's a pretty good. Probably a 7 out of 10 now. And yeah, so there we go. Three bad boys from Pop in a Box. Feel free to check them out. I do have a referral code. It's uh, all capitals M-I-C-H-A-E-L-A dash R-6-F. It'll save you 10% when you make your account for the first time. On orders, I think it has to be like more than 20 bucks. You have to buy like at least two pops kind of thing. 20 bucks before shipping and taxes. Um, gives you a nice little test out. Eventually I get some credit when yours get delivered, which is kind of nice. And it gives you a chance to test it for a little bit cheaper. I'll also be posting these pictures up on my Instagram at FunkoPopCollector99. Feel free to pop on over and check it out. If you like the content, please feel free to like and subscribe. Have a fantastic evening.